Time to go on to our next contest. The following singles matchup is scheduled for one fall with a 15 minute time limit. Your official for this contest, referee Sparky Beller. Buddy Royal and Vinny Dragon for it. So. Well, Buddy Royal and Vinny Dragon. 
and drag and make our way back to the ringside area. And someone has not fastened our, our guardrails properly, and they almost fell onto the fans in the front row. I'm sure they're getting what they paid for. I think they were fastened correctly, he, he, he hit them so damn hard, he knocked them into it, that the, the, the fasteners just broke. What the hell is he going for? Now drag it. Oh! Oh my goodness! Luckily, he landed on his feet, he almost landed on the hot chick in the front row. Whoa! And a super kick miss. And now Royal. Royal leaving. Oh, buddy Royal's turned town and left the ringside area. Okay, well, hey, wait, they're coming back. A boy, buddy Royal got his clock cleaned in the backstage area, and now they're making their way back in. Well, oh, oh my god! Power slam on the floor! This match of actually was sanctioned as a street fight. I mean, I mean, I guess there's only so much a sparking can do. Match start. Speaking, it uh, has started. Uh, I kind of disagree with that call, but whatever. Yeah. Well, Buddy Royal looking to get a count out victory here. I don't want the six. I don't like Buddy Craig. I mean, the guy should at least have a chance to compete. I mean. He's got it up to eight. He's got two more seconds. No, tonight, can Craig and make his way back in? Will they get counted out? Yes, he's in. Buddy Royal going right to work. Royal not giving him any chance to breathe. And Dragon looks like he's favoring his midsection there. I mean, he's been he's been complaining a lot of mid about a lot of midsection pain over the last couple of days. And that's just a matter of whether or not Buddy Royal knows it. And if he does, he's going to zero in on it. Oh, for a pin. Very nice. Well, like, you, like you're saying about, about him complaining about that midsection, that pain in the midsection. No, you probably shouldn't give. Your opponents, uh, a little bit, of, uh, you probably shouldn't give them scouting data like that. And now, chin lock applied. And Blair Royal trying to choke out, uh, choke out Vinny Dragon, make a fight for each and every breath while he gets a breather. Almost in midsection, and now Dragon off of the ropes. And he's up on the shoulders! Nice takedown. Almost like a, a victory roll there. That's what I thought he was going for at first, but no. Set up for Dragon's breath. Oh, oh, look at the agility there. Whoa! He's got him up! No! Down hard. What a whiplash effect that was. Just bounces out on the ground like a damn basketball. That's the story of Tommy applied. Or, what you saying? Well, Scorpion Law, Sharpshare, or what have you. Either way, it's hell for your back, and it's definitely a lot of pain in the knees, your shin. Pretty much your entire lower body is in hell. That sucks. <laughs> I, I do not recommend anybody be put in one. And a clever move there by, by uh, Royal, by yanking the dragon away from the bottom rope. And he almost has a cinch in there. Right. Dragon grabbed the bottom rope. And uh, Buddy Royal busted open. But, oh yeah, little, yeah, he is tasting a little bit of blood there. It's one of the drawbacks. It's one of the drawbacks putting on the outside. Dare say wrestling as a whole. Don't expect it to get out of this place without blood or bruises on you. And both these men already worn down. I mean, this uh, oh. all that the fight before the match. And uh, Buddy Royal, kind of a vain man in his own right. I'm sure he's a little extra pissed off with the notion he just ruined his moneymaker. Uh, he'll be all right. The trips up Dragon. Dragon a compromise. Oh! oh my goodness. Thankfully his feet caught him. He would have gone head first onto the floor. A great core straight displayed by Venice Dragon. 
Yeah, but what is what does he have what does he have to go up to? Oh, oh. Nothing but all of uh, Buddy Royal's body weight coming across his face. We're at a standstill here. Both men laid out on the outside and Clark doesn't know what to do. Let's at least get one of these men. Depends if we can have a conclusive finish. No fan wants to see a double count out. Okay, vintage Dragon wor definitely works for wear here. Sparky initiating the 10 count. And one of the down points of beating up your opponent on the outside, now you got to drag dead weight inside have to get him into the ring. He is completely, he's nearly lifeless right now. This has got to be it. One. That's it. Whoa! whoa! Vintage kicked out! Vintage Dragon still has plenty of life left in him. But does Buddy Royal, I mean... <laughs> These guys have beat the hell out of, each other, out of each other so much, this match might be stopped. Well, as told, yes, Sparky Bell is called whether or not he wants to call this matchup as a draw or, or stop it on account of injury or blood loss, what have you. Sparky Bell are definitely California's best official, you know, no knock to guys like Rick Knox because they're right there with him. I mean, he's definitely one of the best and most reliable. A man that cannot be bought off, that cannot be squared, a man that does what he has to do to see to it. That is called right down the middle and that the better man wins at all times. And both men back up to their feet. Right hand. Royal, dragon, royal, dragon, and royal, snap. Jam it to the side of the head. Now shoots him in the opposite end. Dragon just close right off the opposite. And tilts the world! Face buster. All of them put the world uh, hit them to take down, but I think he just drove them four head first into the tent. Now Vinny, taking a big risk here, he's going to go for the six star Santon. Oh, he got all of it. Number one. Whoa. Wow. He got a six star Santon on a one count. That is unfathomable. Buddy Royal showing off his, uh, his prowess and his heart. Think about what kind of psychological damage that does. A guy hits you with his best shot and you kick out on one. Well, he's gonna try to go for it again. Will he make it six stars? If he can connect with this, will that be it? Here he goes, and he got it! Twice in a row, one, two, no! Yeah, you saw the surprise look on Sparky's face. Even he thought it was over. I, I, I... It's a six star St. Tom, it's a seven star St. Tom. Maybe he's gonna go for eight. I don't know, but Buddy Royal kicks out on one and then kicks out at two. I mean, Our Dragon's looking to wipe out Royal, but what does he have in mind? What does he do? You've hit him with your best shot twice. Looks like he's gonna try to go for it again. That's not the way to say. Wait, Royal, make him on his feet. Make his man to the top. Oh my goodness! Vintage Dragon over the top rope! And he just splattered on the mat like a bum on a windshield. But does he have enough energy to cover? He's in there, one, two, no! I mean, to be fair, how the hell did Vintage Dragon just kick out of that? I mean, <laughs> well, it is one of his monikers that is in that long introduction I had to give him is pure instinct. The man has it. Whenever you hear something smack the mat twice, it is just pure instinct to get your shoulder off of the canvas regardless of how you feel. These fans of Santa Maria, California, you are watching two men give it their all for you. I really hope that, um, that you and the rest of the powers that be here have been in the are opening your eyes to these two men. Give them, whoa! Two super kicks missed. Grabs on, hold the arm, float over. Final driver! Pull him out like a pogo stick. When you gotta go and you gotta make the cover. You gotta make the cover. You can't take forever to get over there, too. He's too busy about it. Too busy celebrating about it. Look at that. I mean, a little Asher uh, insult to injury. Zero respect. What's right, what's right going for now? He's giving uh, he's giving Dragon way too much time to, to recover from that uh, pile driver. And as a rest of the square guard behind Minute Dragon. And no! Oh, yeah, yeah. That's gonna crack his tail. 
Rumble. Roddy Royal completely missed that sit, uh, <clears throat> the Swanton Bomb. Or maybe his version of the Five Star Swanton. Here comes Dragon. Eight One more time. Can it be it? Will it be it? Yes! But damn it, he is a fantastic competitor. But tonight, the win, the adulation, the adulation goes to Vintage Track.